My name is Lauren Tuck. I am the co-founder of Tuck's Rush for Literacy, a charitable organization that my husband Justin and I co-founded in 2008. And I really consider myself a nonprofit professional in addition to leading that organization. I've done some uh, executive consulting for other nonprofits and a significant amount of board work. I became connected with literacy because my passion is really children and education. And the foundation of any education is literacy, the ability to read. Up until third grade, you learn to read. After that, you read to learn. So it's so important that children get that skill. And that's uh, one of the reasons that we set out to close the opportunity gaps in that space. My involvement in my community uh, really stems from the deeper philosophical and spiritual belief that to whom much is given, much is expected. And I myself am uh, the beneficiary of an excellent education. My husband and I, when we were looking at our own children, we're proud parents of two young boys, we wanted the best for them. But it occurred to me that, that I, we want the best for all children. And so we enrolled our children in the local public school system and decided to put all of our time, talents, and treasures uh, into that effort. And that's what ultimately led me to uh, running last year for the Board of Education and um, proudly stepping up and serving my town in that way. The mission of the Y really resonates with me with female empowerment and combating racism. These are both issues that have touched me personally. Uh, when I ran, when I campaigned for the Board of Education, I had a female mentor, uh, a freeholder in Bergen County who was really um, really influential and um, beneficial to me. My sister is a surgeon and I've seen in her career um, some very real obstacles that she's faced as a woman and a woman of color. I think it's so important to be brave and be out there and to share your story and to make sure that you're opening doors as uh, behind you as people open them in front of you. I don't know who to attribute this quote to, but um, talent is evenly distributed, opportunity is not. I would like to see more opportunity, to see that uh, more equally distributed, and I hope that through my work in the nonprofit sector and now in, in the government that I will be able to help open more doors and create more opportunities, whether that's simply giving someone a book. We know that physically having a library at home can impact a child's ability to read, or if it's something on a larger scale uh, policy-wise, that's, that's the legacy I, I hope to to leave, that's what I'm working towards.